do, here's how we'll fix voting in this country. I, I laid this out yesterday. Yesterday was election day. I voted in my home state in Ohio yesterday. And when I came out, I just felt it was simple. It was a paper ballot. It was government issued ID that I brought with me. Here's the thing that we need. Okay, if the left really believes the reason we can't have this conversation on YouTube is that supposedly even talking about the subject of election integrity is a threat to our democracy, as you'll hear on a given day of the week. Funniest expression you'll hear, and there's so much wrong with it. We live in a constitutional republic, not a democracy. Our democracy, whose democracy exactly? But that's what you'll hear. It's a threat to our democracy to even have this conversation. Well, here's, here's a truce in terms of how we move forward. I don't want a national divorce. I want a national revival. Here's what I'll say when I'm president. Here's how we'll do it. Paper ballots, single day voting on election day. People have work, they say. Fine, make election day a national holiday so everyone has an equal opportunity to do it. And government issued ID to match the voter file. That's it. If we reach that achievement, you have my pledge. The people of this country have my pledge that I will lead all Americans, including all Republicans, to move on to stop complaining about ballot fraud or election interference. We're done with it. I will keep that promise. I will say we're done with it. We will not be victims. We refuse to wallow in our own victimhood. But just fix the basics here. If it's really that much of a threat to our democracy, this should be a very practical solution to deliver. Paper ballots, single day voting on election day, which I'm open to make a national holiday and government issued ID to match the voter file. With that, we're done. We move forward as a country. And the fact that that is controversial smokes out what's really going on here. And I think that it takes a candidate who is willing to actually engage, not in grievance, but on principle to move this nation forward. And that's why I'm in the race.